Hey, DJ Mikey Mike in Direct Sound, and we're doing it from scratch today with uh, Chevet Show Express 6.0, and we're doing importing and exporting shows, and some of the things that I've learned so far, uh, how to save shows as different names, how to import shows, how to import scenes, uh, and how it affects your uh, your scene folder. So, um, the first thing you need to do is build a folder and call it uh, something unique on your, in your My Documents folder because My Documents seems to be easiest to map to in the uh, the mapping area where you go to. Okay, um, I have a scene or a folder in My Documents called, I have several, but Show Express ZZZ and there's a default already exported into there because I'm exporting the default show. Uh, one thing I want to show you is when you're importing scenes, and we go to the scene file, notice I have all BBB blue and chase. I'm going to rename chase to CCCCCCC chase. Okay? Just for an example. I'm going to X out of that. Okay, so I'm going to open up my editor, and I'm going to go to my scenes, and you notice the BBB blue is in there. But all chase is regular chase. Okay? You don't see the C chase anymore. So this is going to tell us if it actually worked for the import. Okay, so when you're importing a show, it only brings in the new scenes. And I guess if you redo a scene, it might overwrite the new scene uh, or the old scene. It might, if it's named the same, it might overwrite it. So I, I don't know about that yet. I haven't tried. Uh, to change the name, or I mean to uh, to overwrite, but we'll we'll figure that out later. Uh, but it does import shows that you don't have, and I will show you how that works. So first off, you you created your folder in your My Documents area. Uh, you go to the control board, and there's a few things here that's real important. You go to the Settings tab, and that's located right on the control board where the little uh, wrench and screwdriver is. It opens up the settings profile tab and you notice this nice little name default that is the default name as you're exporting shows that's why they always say all say de uh, um, default now this little asterisk here means right here must restart control board so if you uh, change the name of a show you won't see it unless you restart your control board okay so um, and then that's to validate the settings. I hit that, the control board goes away, everything sets up, and it works out fine. So to rename a light show, you can click this button right here, and you can save this as a new show. We call it uh, P-A-R-T-Y-1-2-3. Kind of weird spelling there. And uh, hit OK. And if we hit uh, it's not going to be there right now. And see in the drop down, it's not there. But if we validate the settings and open it back up, and now we drop down to the party one, two, three, and validate the settings, that's going to be your new default light show. Okay, so when you open up your control board, check that list. When you open up your control board, in your editor um, oh, I think I already had it open. when you open up your editor and you go to your light scenes I don't have anything in my light scenes because of light shows party one two three scenes aren't created also what's not created are any of the lights so I it's a whole new light show so if you want to create light shows and call them you know school or wedding or different venues you can do it that way and save them and all your lights will you know whatever lights you use in the venue will be there blah 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 whatever you want to do okay but if you want to import scenes to that light show you can import them by going to um, the import mode but um, let's uh, X out of this and go back to default because I want to show you the import feature Okay, so we're going to go back to the default light show. I had to restart the control board. Now we're set to default. Okay, now I'm going to X out of this. 
and go back to the editor just to show you and now my lights are back and my scenes are back okay and remember that chase scene with all the C's we're gonna go back to that real quick here okay so X out of the all this I just want to show you we're gonna go to import import a light show okay and notice it's easy to map documents because it's just right here on mine I'm gonna go to my documents folder I'm gonna go to the ZZZ show that I uh, one to map to, and it's going to be called default. Click on the default name, and then hit import. Okay, that's all it takes. It doesn't give you any message saying that it, it's worked. It didn't do anything. It doesn't tell you anything. I wish it would. The last one kind of told you, you know, you had three scenes and one this, that, and the other thing, or whatever. But this one doesn't do that. Anyway, okay. So X out, and now we're going to open up the editor one more time. I'm going to go to my scenes folder. And now all C C C C C C C is in there, so it only imported the stuff that we did. Um, also, I, like I said, I don't know if it if it overwrites uh, the newer scenes if you change something. So I'm not quite sure. Uh, we'll have to play around with that a little bit. So um, we're gonna X out of that. So now you can see that it actually does do an import for scenes. Okay. And uh, if you wanted to go back and change that, you could map to the folder and just change the name of whatever you want to do. But uh, oh, that's up to you. I just kind of want to show you that. Okay, so you know how to, one, go to the editor page and select different light shows right here, like being the current light show, whatever you want. Um, I can't, I haven't figured out how to say party one, two, three, and I'm going to activate that and then go back to settings. And now that's the current light show, right? I want to try this. I don't know if I can do it. Okay, I want to import a light show. Let's go to uh, the ZZZ one. And import default. Import. X out. And open up the editor. And it didn't import, and I don't understand why it doesn't import when there's not a a scene or something built. So that's a good question to ask uh, in the forum section. Um, it should have imported the CCCCC, and it should have imported the lights that I already have in this, but it doesn't. I don't know why. Um, I have no clue. Anyway, uh, that's something for us to figure out. So... Um, but that's with us saved as the new show. Now, if I were to export that show and then start importing scenes from other shows, it worked. But to create the whole new show, I don't know why it doesn't do that. Okay, maybe it needs to be named the exact same thing. I have no clue. Okay, so, uh, so like, import default to default, import uh, Z. You know, let's try that real quick. How can we do that? Um, Let's try to cheat here and go to my documents. ZZZ. Oh, I called default in there. So I didn't export anything as what it mean. Oh well. We'll figure that out. Anyway, um, no lights to play with uh, unless I bring in lights. Uh, that's all that. <laughs> DJ Mikey Mike with direct sound. That's all the time we have. Uh, for this little tutorial, uh, hopefully it kind of opened your eyes a little bit on how to import and export scenes uh, and renaming your light shows, okay, and how you can play with those. Uh, still need a I still need to learn a little bit more about it. Uh, I'm not totally familiar with it, but it kind of gets you guys into it uh, just a little bit more. All right, peace.